Thank you for joining us today. My name is Steve, and I'm here to give you a tour of the Stream TV app powered by RCN. Stream TV is an app that lets you enjoy your must-see TV favorites from local news, live sports, and entertainment. The app is designed for students and is included with room and board for students living in on-campus housing. It's easy to use and lets you stream live TV and on-demand shows directly to your Apple and Android smart device, all while staying connected to your campus network. Plus, if you have existing streaming subscriptions such as Netflix, Hulu, or Amazon Prime, the app interface can search across these services to show you additional ways to watch a show you're looking for. Let's take a closer look. The Stream TV app is currently available to download on Android smart devices running 7.0 or later and Apple devices running iOS 13.0 or later. TVs, laptops, Roku, and other devices are not supported at this time, but we continue to work on making the Stream TV app available on more devices in the future. As more devices are added, we'll be sure to let you and your campus personnel know. First, you'll need to download the app to your device. To make it simple, go to rcn.com glaw. At the bottom of the page, you'll see a direct link to the Google Play Store and Apple iTunes Store. Once you've downloaded the app, Open it and you'll be taken to a login screen. There, you'll need to enter the username and password we've assigned to you. Be sure to check your email as we've sent this information to you in advance. If you do not have an email or cannot locate it, please email support at i4dm.com or call 410-995-8444 to retrieve it. It's important to know that you will not be able to click Forgot Username or Password from the login screen to retrieve it. You must email support at i4dm.com or call 410-995-8444 to retrieve it if you do not have it handy. Here we'll cover both the Android and iOS versions of the app and we'll show the differences between the two versions with Android being on the left and iOS being on the right. The basic operation of the app is the same regardless of Android or iOS device usage. When you log in for the first time, you'll be taken to the What to Watch screen, where you can find exciting content ready to watch. To navigate through the app with the Android version, select the menu button in the upper left-hand corner to get the other options. In the iOS version, all of the options are located on the smart bar at the bottom of the screen. To find a program to watch, select the Guide option. The guide will appear on your screen and you can scroll up and down through all of the channels to see what is on. Or you can change the viewing time of the guide by hitting the time arrows in the upper right hand corner. Once a program is selected from the guide, the program screen will be displayed. To play the program and watch it live, click the play arrow. You can also click on the drop down arrow to restart a show from the beginning if it's already started. The Start Over feature will only be available for up to three days. The ability to start over a show is dictated by the content provider and may vary by network. Fast forwarding may also be disabled on some shows and is controlled by the content provider. While watching live TV, if you tap on the screen while the program is playing, several options will appear. To go back to the main menu, click Done. To see the guide and change channels, tap on the drop-down arrow. If you want the program to start from the beginning, click on Catch Up. At the bottom of the screen, you'll see a scrub bar, volume controls, and closed captioning options. Please note that if you click on Get This Show, recording and setting a one-pass is not an option at this time. On-demand content can be accessed by selecting the On-demand option in the menu or on the smart bar. All content can be browsed. Only free subscription on-demand can be watched. The ability to purchase an on-demand movie is not available. We're excited to offer the Stream TV app to your campus. We thank you for your time and hope this information was helpful. Before you go, please remember these important items. The Stream TV app is only available on compatible devices. Content is made available by your institution through an agreement with RCN, and you must use the login provided in order to access the content. There's a maximum of five simultaneous live TV streams per account. The app is currently available to download on Android smart devices running 7.0 or later and Apple devices running iOS 13.0 or later. TVs, laptops, Roku, and other devices are not supported at this time. You will need to download the app to your device. Visit rcn.com glaw to get direct access to the app link. You will need to log in with a username and password provided to you. If you do not have your username and password, email support at i4dm.com or call 410-995-8444.
To stream live TV on campus, you must be connected to your on-campus network. You will not be able to live stream TV off campus. When searching a show, if you see results for Netflix, Hulu, or Amazon Prime as a way to watch, you will need to have a separate subscription to that service. If you do not have a subscription, you will not be able to access this content. The Start Over feature is only available for up to three days. The ability to start over a show may vary by network, is dictated by the content provider, and is subject to change at any time. Fast-forwarding may be disabled on some shows and is controlled by the content provider.